All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Sir Riot. That's Sir Frankers. And today is April 24th on April 30th. So we play as an experienced journalist who always strives to uncover the truth. He manages to gain access to the house, which is guarded by the police in connection with the terrible incident. So without further ado, let's get into it. Chapter 1, The Wicked. Oh, we're in the basement? Oh, man. It's 3.30 in the afternoon. Ooh, nice little heater. I feel like we should pick this up right now, but it's not going to let us. All right, let's work our way up. Is that bleach? No, it doesn't look like bleach. Should we check? Let's check the basement before we go upstairs. Alright, that's creepy. Oh, that just gave me chills. I don't want to go upstairs now. I want to make sure I don't need anything. Oh no. We don't have a sprint, by the way. Oh. <laughs> Gotta zoom. I don't know how I feel about that. Holy shit. Okay. Well, that's a good start. Are you handing me the axe? Or are you gonna kill me? Oh. Where are your shoes, man? I like the suit. I like the hat. Not, I don't like the face very much. Oh god. She shouldn't have done that in your bed. Done what? She deserves to be punished. Oh man, I hope I read this in time. Dear Ben, you've been living in the basement for months and haven't come out. You're going crazy and dragging us along. The kids and I don't understand what's going on with you. You've become aggressive and you're talking all out of your anger on us, taking all your all of your anger out on us. Alice is sick. It's hard for her to live in such an environment and Jacob is still too young and I don't want him to get hurt. You know that we have the right to live without you. I try to discuss everything with you in a normal setting, but you don't make contact. I just want to know that we have someone who will take care of us all you have to do is let us go. Let us do this. Sincerely, Evelyn. Chapter 2, April 24th, 1991. Alright, so now it's 3.15 in the morning. Ugh. What do you want, man? Son of a bitch. Alright, I'm going. But what's going on over here? Fine. Why do I have an axe? Am I supposed to go kill her? Or did it already happen? There seems to be a struggle going on here. And you're really making me, uh, really making me do this. Do it. Is 
this the kids room Aww. there's a baby now I'm sad let's find this bitch's room Layout's kind of nice. Just a master. Okay, the layout's a little weird, not gonna lie. You hiding from us? <laughs> you just fucking jackass, god damn it. Do it. My name is Sean Miller. I am conducting a journalist investigation of a brutal murder on the outskirts of the city that occurred on April 24th. I want to find out the true cause of this crime and find answers to all questions. Chapter 3 Observer. Oh, so he was watching it. Oh, are we in the house? He's watching it in the house? Oh, you've got balls of steel, man. On April 24th, a brutal, brutal murder took place in a house on the outskirts of the city. A man killed his entire family with an axe and accused himself, called the police, and was arrested on the spot. The man said... The man testifies and says that he was influenced by a certain man in a hat, and they forced him to commit this crime. The police have no further comment. We'll monitor developments in this case. Pieces of me. Hearing footsteps running. Do I put the tape in? Probably could have let the TV on. Chapter 4 Pieces of Pieces of Me. Man, I can't talk today. we locked in now? Should we lock people in? Did we already kill them? Okay. Are we, trying to, are we trying to keep the man out? I'll pick the hammer up. It's so dark in here. I was expecting something to be on the couch. We used to have a TV like this. I remember those knobs. Oh man, I think I'm getting old. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Alright, do we go through here? Need a hook or a knife, and there's something behind me. Oh, it's a different bear. You whispering to the bear? I just don't want that thing to move. No. Get out of here. Oh 
No, 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 no. Nope, nope, nope. I don't like the raspiness. Just noticed that. How do I equip the knife? Do I? <laughs> I hate that I can't look around right now. I don't trust him. Ain't going to these drawers. I'm assuming wherever there's a handprint, that's what we can interact with. But you never know. The sounds in this game. Someone's crying. I can't see in there. We go upstairs. Oh, what are you doing? You eating the dog or something? Such a joyful laugh is now terrorizing. <laughs> oh. Let's check down here first. We gotta find a key. I really hate that there's no sprint. It makes me so uncomfortable. <laughs> Someone dropped something. Oh god. Alright, I'm panicking. Ooh, crowbar. Anything else? Alright, nothing else in here. I was waiting for something. Who broke what? Come on. Fess up. It's probably expensive. Robert's gotta be for that door. Ah, it went upside down. That's. It's not unsettling. Why would you do that now? Oops. I'm messing with the door. Still 3.15 a.m. seen anything of use yet. Can't go in these cupboards. We just gotta move the chair. No. Try this door. Oh open, open. Whoa no 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 no. God I hate not sprinting. Hello? Scary lady. I'm just gonna keep... Ooh, is that the key? Can I have... <laughs> Can I have it? Thank you. Which door is it for, this one? Can I shut this? Oh. Makes it feel a little bit better. This feels like a maze. 
Yeah, layout's a little strange. It's very confusing, which I kind of like, as far as the game goes. Alright, let's work our way down this eerie dark hallway. Is this... There's a coffin here. It just knocked. Oh. Is it anything? Nothing? Okay. What was that noise? Wait. Isn't that where we came from? Okay, get me out. Get me out. Oh, God. I don't know if you guys heard it, but there was humming coming from that coffin. I'll go through here now. Okay, so we did come from this way. Yeah, we're in hell. Hello? What is this? Something's behind me. I don't know what we're looking at though, just a couple boxes, some rope. There's a brick wall behind it. Oh, so that's the, <laughs> that's the basement. I was expecting something to be behind us since we heard the noises. Wait, right, we're boarded back in? We came through there, right? I am watching. <laughs> Who's ever doing the voice? It's terrifying. Alright, let's go. One step at a time, right? Yeah? Do I have to? you we kill you say we killed <laughs> now, uh. do I have to go closer Get ready, guys. <laughs> Bitch still got me. Let's go back up. I don't know what's going on on the right side there, but we're going to ignore it. That's fine. I wanted that door shut anyway. Where am I, where, where am I going? Not that way. Let's check down this hallway. Tie the ropes to the doors. What doors? These doors? Why is the coffin open? Why are we tying them shut? Should we be leaving? Uh, we got this door. Close and board the coffin. Do it faster! Uh, close it! Yeah! We need to find a cross and put it on the coffin. Do 
the one over here. I don't remember seeing one. Let's grab the one from the kitchen. It is warm in here. Damn it, it's gone? So is the one above the door. The only one would be in the basement that I saw. Alright, there's that bookshelf. I think that's to our left if we go towards the coffin. And one book was miscolored. It should be right there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Ooh! What is that? No, what? Grab the book! Wait. Was it. Did it open something? <laughs> Fucking bitch! God damn it! Really, that's where the cross is? <laughs> Jesus. Hey there, little fella. Let me see what she got there. Alice, Mom, me, and Jacob. Oh, he. <laughs> you stay there. You keep drawing. Chapter 5, The Touch of Evil. I'm sweating. Why are you in the house? Doing this. Like, grab the tapes and run, dude. Although there's... God, there's a lot of tapes. Oh, we're... This jerk... We're dead. This is not... This is not worth the story. Need to lock the door with a chair. Yeah. Got it, got it, got it. Mm. What the hell are you doing here? I, d <laughs> I don't want to get closer. Okay, nothing. So we gotta look for another tape, maybe? I'm counting the 6th, September 7th. Ooh, look at that. Nice little Easter egg. Is there something in here? Oh, yeah. Proof of death. Let's pop her in, see what she is. Chapter 6 Proof of Death. Oh, my good golly gosh. Oh, there's a rat. Oh. <laughs> Just feeding on him. God. Ew. Let's see if we can open these doors. This one's like chain shut. Can't do anything with it. Ah, uh, here we go.
We gotta saw our way out of here. Something's gonna... Who the fuck are you? N no. <laughs> no. <clears throat> I need a key. Yeah, we still haven't found a key yet. Can't go in that room. I can open this door with a bolt cutter. Alright, so we need to find a key. And bolt cutters. Wait. I need to find the passcode. Oh god, there's too many things going on now for me. I don't remember seeing any numbers anywhere. Wait, do I need to find two passcodes? Here, hang on, we gotta try it. Damn. 3C. 3 and C. What? 3B? 3B, 3C, 3B. Okay. A little child whispering. It's terrifying. Nothing on there. Ooh. 5D, 335. Ooh, and there's our crowbar. CBD. Ooh. Four. Three. Three. Oh, no, wait, no. So it's four. Three. Three, five. We did it. Yay! Thumbs to my back left corner. We're going to ignore it. Dear Ben, I can't live like this anymore. I want to get a divorce and sell a house. More torment has become unbearable, and I need freedom. Please give me the opportunity to start a new chapter in my life. Sincerely, Evelyn. these people what was the key for upstairs yep. uh. little twitchy thing This one, right? Yeah. Alright, so we're stuck up here for now. Nothing in the drawers. You know something's wrong. There's a lot of pills like that. Is this the daughter's room? <laughs> oh. Uh. oh, here we go. Alright, got the bolt cutters. There's a note here. A leaf from the diary. Dear diary, mom and dad were fighting again today. If I wasn't a burden, I could help them with little Jacob. He requires a lot of attention and, and give them a lot of trouble. 
It hurts me so much to look at them and see how they suffer because of me and Jacob. If I hadn't been there, my parents would have been much happier. They would have to worry about my they wouldn't have to worry about my health. I feel useless and unnecessary, and I would like to be the best daughter for them, Alice. That's sad. So there's something going on with her. There she needed a wheelchair and medical attention. And this dude cut her head off? Jesus Christ, man. There's something behind the door. I need to find something to open it with. We had a crowbar. What'd you do with it? Alright, let's go on. Which should be the cutest room ever, but will probably be most terrifying. Alright, we can't. Can we? What? Oh! I'm kind of glad I looked away. Alright, things are picking up. Which one am I supposed to go? What's that noise? Let's open up this door. Something. Or we're, we're about to get attacked. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh god. Grab it. Why won't you grab it? This way again, right? You what the fuck kind of doll is that? Nope. Nope. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I already knew that. I didn't I didn't need your help. Why in here? Downstairs, just open up a door. So, where are we going with the axe? <clears throat> Swing it. It's the parents' room, right? Yeah. Current day? Chapter 7. There is no way out. So wait, did he just see himself on the tape from 1999? My guy, like, hop out the window. What are you doing here? There is no way out. Yeah, I'm making that clear. Can you grab this? What are you pointing at, little dude? Crowbar? Oh, 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 where'd you go? Give me the same newspaper and stuff. Yeah. Uh, all right. Shit. I'm I'm sweating. What? It's a hotel. Oh. Fuck. 
Okay. Just keep, just keep opening. Yeah. It's a noose. I found a picture of a noose trying to get out of the house. Yeah, I see where it's good as dead. <laughs> and now it's dark. Son of a bitch. Oh no. Oh no. There's bricks behind the doors. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> do it. There's a chair behind me, isn't there? Oh, it's the clock. Suicide note. Do I, ha I have to? Come on. Gonna write a note. I've completed this investigation, but unfortunately, I will not be able to publish it. This house is a source of madness. It has consumed me. I wanted to find the truth, but instead I found death. It's all about the man in the hat. He oppresses his victims and makes them do terrible things. Ben recorded everything on tapes. I saw that man forcing Ben to kill his wife for cheating. But it wasn't enough for him. He continued to stalk him until Ben killed his entire family. Now I'm his next victim, and I can't stand up to him. Sean Miller. Do we do it? Oh no. Come on. Let me out the window. You son of a bitch. It's not over yet. What the hell, man? Oh, is a rat starting to eat us? He's down by our feet. <laughs> 